No one is talking about how being corrupted by a chaos god is an absolute nightmare. So let me give you an example of what it actually looks like. And be warned, it gets pretty disturbing. So Slaanesh is the god of excess, which means hedonism, depravity, addiction, all of that. And being corrupted by them starts off incredibly subtly. We'll use a good old fashioned steak as an example of what their corruption looks like. If you've never had one before, they're absolutely delicious. Slaanesh will give this to you. And you'll be like, this is the best thing I've ever eaten. But after a few weeks of eating nothing but steak, your taste buds will get bored of it. It will lose all of its flavor. So Slaanesh will tell you to try veal. Now you're experiencing that pleasure from before, but it's even better. But then once again, you'll get no pleasure out of it. So then the chaos god will offer you veal created by a five-star chef, and then you'll get bored of that. And then Slaanesh will say, what if the steak came from your best friend, Steve? And then what if Steve was still alive while you ate it? And then what if all of his friends and family had to watch? And it just gets darker and darker. This is all after only been in contact with Slaanesh for a few years. The once proud emperor's children have been following Slaanesh for 10,000 years. They're not doing okay.